guys welcome back to the channel Yosh Crafter. my name is julie and today i have got a magazine flip through for you guys so this is cross stitcher and it's issue 403 december 2023 so let's have a look at the free gifts that we got so we've got some metallic threads so stitch and sparkle metallic threads seven beautiful colors to glitz your christmas stitching so very nice yeah very glittery very sparkly yeah stitch and sparkle so very very nice then the other free gift is snow much fun and it's a tag gift tag set so it includes the white ada the stranded cotton the printed card tags and the easy stitch chart is in the magazine so yeah you get the uh, the tag forms you get the thread some ada and a needle so, so it just says white ada fabric so it doesn't say what count it is it just says white ada so i think yeah you can get all four on that one piece because they're only small so we've got uh, the snowman we've got a polar bear we've got a penguin and we've got a reindeer very cute very cute little tags <clears throat> excuse me does it say no it doesn't say it might say in the magazine so let's get into it so we've got the uh, stocking on the front that's the main pattern we've got stitch a stylish cushion get your skates on tote cool tote bag for christmas shopping polar bear cards a silent night scene um and then it just says add sparkle using your exclusive threads so let's cover those uh, the patterns so the gift tag uh set is from susan penny so yeah susan penny and next month we have a christmas envelope kit so make christmas extra special for your family by stitching up a dear santa envelope kit so that will be in next month's so then we have the welcome page from susan and martin penny and then we have the full contents page so what's included in this issue and we have a leaflet for get a cross stitcher subscription at a snip so yeah cut to the chase and alleviate your cross stitching today <laughs> very cute So let's have a look. So it says uh, book of the month for cross stitcher is uh, 20 to stitch Christmas cross stitch by Michelle Powell. And then we've got the out there. Then we have firm favourites with Hannah Braniff. Braniff? Yeah, Braniff. And what they've been stitching. And then we have the Julian Odez uh, gives words of wisdom and how to flourish when stitching or in life and reminds us there are an alternative ways to celebrate. So we have. <laughs> <laughs> we've got a fella llama a fella llama <laughs> very cute <clears throat> the uh 
then we have Willow Fabrics. Very cute. Oops. Then we have the Seasonal Houses. And this is Rivington. So, yeah, that's the Seasonal Houses. Then we have Winter Wonderland. So Santa and his reindeers are all decked out for Christmas, making this a magical winter wonderland stocking for a little one. So yeah, we've got the uh, stocking there. And that is by Maria Diaz. So the Christmas stocking from Maria Diaz. Very nice. And then we've got Bear Club Hugs. Our polar bear mum and cub cards make the most adorable way to send season's greetings this Christmas. So yeah, Bear Club Hugs. And these are by Amanda Butler. <coughs> Just take a drink. So yeah by Amanda Butler then we have needles and notions your stitching top tips online chat and more then we have Christmas corners oh so deck the halls with our tremendous triangular cushion Blech tremendous triangular cushion it's packed with the merriest mix and match christmas characters so yeah i've got a santa a fox a reindeer an elf a penguin a polar bear another elf a snowman i've got a rabbit and i think that's mrs claus yeah so this one is Emma Congdon. Yeah, very cute. Christmas Corners. Yeah, very cute. So it's 172 high by 121 wide. Yeah. So you can stitch it all as one, but then it's shown you can do them individually says you will have enough ada and backing fabric left over to make two hanging decorations from the 10 designs available make them <coughs> make them in the same way as the cushion adding bells and a hanger made from ribbon so yeah i think if you buy the uh, pack from uh, willow fabrics so yeah once you've made the cushion then you can make two additional so there's enough supplies so i need to fold the magazine over so give me a second yeah because we've got half the, we've got the pattern on the other side so this is silent night it says create an excitement of christmas eve in 3d with our cute scene that doubles as a decoration uh, <clears throat> very cute so you've know, got the scene in the background there and then they've done like a a bed a box to make the bed like a 3d yeah very cute and who is that one by that is cheryl mckinnon so it's a tiny modernist so yeah, that is a tiny modernist and it's Silent Night. So very cute. Yeah. Very cute. So right. There we go. And there's an advertisement for Cross Stitcher Digital. And then we've got festive fizz. Spread some Christmas cheers 
with our pair of seasonal cocktail coasters. Time to whip up some mulled wine in readiness. So yeah, I've got some little designs there. You can make them into coasters. So yeah, stitch some Christmas cocktails. And those are by Emma Congdon. So stitch Rovia. Then we have an interview, so you can read that. And then we've got another one with the pattern on the other half of the page. And it's with the magazine again. So this is the New York one. So party in the park. Cool. So New York, New York. What better backdrop for our Christmas tote bag than a Central Park snow-filled scene? Get your stitching skates on. So this is Central Park, New York. Look at that. I love that. Ice skating in Central Park. <laughs> yeah. So who is this one by? This is, let's see, Cheryl McKinnon. So it's a tiny modernist. So let me show you again. So Central Park, New York. I love that. So yeah, Cheryl McKinnon, a tiny modernist. I, yeah, if you know, you know. <laughs> yeah, absolutely. Mm -hmm. So, yeah, 110 high by 80 wide. That is just gorgeous. But, uh, yeah. So the, the design was stitched on 14 count Ada. So let me have a look. So the design size is eight by five and three quarter inches on fourteen count. So yeah. Eight by six essentially is the uh, stitched area. So yeah, eight by six. Uh, mm hmm Yeah. So then we have the letter library and we've got Santa's elves. It's alphabet time. Our workshop is full of hard-working elves preparing for Christmas and is ideal for your festive projects. <clears throat> so, those are by... Fiona Crouch. Yeah. Fiona Crouch, the letter library. So then the next page is In My Hoop. So what will the people have been stitching? Oh my gosh. <laughs> oh my gosh. Right. Hang on. Let's try. Cover that top one. And cover that one. And then we can turn over. So we've got Elf on a Shelf. So this is by Susan Penny. The perfect stocking filler gift. Our elf in a tin can be propped up with our tin lid seen behind him to brighten your home. Yeah. So Elf on a Shelf. <laughs> you can stick your own. Yeah, you can stitch your own elf on a shelf. Mm -hmm. So we have the pattern at the top here for the background. And then the one here at the side is the pattern for the elf. Yeah, Susan Penny. 
yeah very very cute so let's 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 let, there we go so then we have some advertisements for stitch tastic and Swigart. and then we've got the sparkle special this special selection of Christmas designs use, mes use metallic thread to add shine and sparkle to your stitch. So these are some ideas to use your metallic threads. So we've got a card there. We've got a Christmas cake banner. And we've got some ideas to do on for napkins. So these are by... Maria Diaz Yeah, and we've got some other different designs as well that you can do in cards Oh, no, these other ones are the ones in the hoop so let me show you so these are different ones but again um, maria diaz yeah so again maria diaz she's done some more festive designs in hoops so we've got the wreaths there we've got noel got some presents some stockings some stars and uh, snowflakes and trees we've got some reindeers so yeah there's uh, some different so this is the um, sparkle collection and they're all from Maria Diaz <clears throat> so yeah we've got the uh, the ideas for the table layout we've got some ideas the little hoops and then we've got some little um, little ones to put onto crackers did it show it on the front there no I can't hang on let me cover it up so we have got some ideas to stitch on crackers so if you make homemade crackers or you buy plain ones from the shop, you can attach a little stitched piece onto your crackers to complete your table decorations. Then we have Create a Classic and this is the Christmas Town. So this is part two of the Christmas town so part one I think was sort of this bit the carolers the car and then this next bit is like Santa no it's sort of all of this page is part two because part one was sort of the car and that scene so this next bit is part two. Yeah. So I don't know whether I'm going to be able to show you the whole design. Yes, I can. Sort of down here at the bottom. So yeah, that first bit there with the car and the building that was part one and then from the Christmas tree and then sort of the person in the middle and then start of that building that's part two and then obviously the other the last bit will be part three so so this create a classic is by Amanda Butler and then it goes into detail so blending for shading beads for dimension and French knots for detailing so we've got some beads there in the wreath 
on the front of that car and then we've got some french knots for some lights that uh, it looks like the dog's running away with <laughs> so next we have the challenge so ready steady stitch we've challenged three designers to use only the materials given to them to create a christmas card with a gingerbread button <clears throat> So the challenge, 14 count Ada, 7 strands of DMC thread and a gingerbread button. So the rules, create a design for a Christmas card featuring a gingerbread button. The design should be no larger than 48 by 38 stitches. Only the materials above can be used and be as creative as possible. So let me show you. So Doreen Jones, she has done a festive baking and it says baked with love. So she's done um, a basket of gingerbread cookies and then she's added the gingerbread button at the front there for decoration. Gingerbread. Then we have Cheryl McKinnon, so a tiny modernist. She has done Christmas stocking. So and it says Merry Christmas with a little stocking and a teddy bear. And she's just put the button at the top there. And then Jane Pruton, Tom, Tom T. Tree. And it's a little gnome. Look at that. <laughs> she says this little totem is guiding the family is guiding the family christmas tree nordic mythology believes that every home has a gonk and if you look after him he will guard the house and keep you safe however if you neglect him watch out he turns into a right little imp <laughs> that is so cute so yeah, he's uh, guarding the Christmas tree and then she's used the uh, gingerbread button as the Christmas tree topper. But how cute. That is so cute. <laughs> Very cute. And yeah, we have the patterns for all three. Yeah, they're very cute. <laughs> so then we have the cross stitcher just for fun. So we've got the crossword, crossword, and the Sudoku. And then we have the stitch along. So the landmarks of Britain and Ireland. So you get the last row. So this is the stitch along complete, I believe. check the pages don't want to come unstuck so I believe yeah that is the last yes so we've got uh, Whitby Abbey York Minster uh, Snowden and London Zoo so these are all designed by Fiona Crouch and it was a stitch along all through this year. And it says next issue will be starting our new mandala meets mindful Sal. An explosion of colour is packed with some great sayings to motivate and inspire. So this is going to be the stitch along for next year. And it shows this one here and it says, you are enough in the centre there. So yeah, we'll be starting our new Mandala Meets Mindful Sal. Yeah. That'll be in the next issue starting for next year. And... 
then always at the back of these magazines are beginners uh, guide um, how to thread your needle french knots beads <clears throat> and then we have the take a tea break so let's cover this up it says these cute reindeers have been made into brooches to wear on your favorite christmas jumper stitched on ecru 18 count ada and mounted on a cute wooden reindeer brooch from willow fabrics so very cute so yeah i've got uh, both designs yeah so if you want to do one a little bit smaller or you want it to actually fill it to fill the hoop yeah so reindeer brooches so then we have next month's wow so a new year of stitching begins so issue 404 for January 2024 on sale the 28th of November so inside this month is classic beauty traditional knot garden design so pause for thought animal thank you cards away in a manger create a nativity in a tin and then what a hoop what a hoot a whole alphabet of owl motifs mm. owl motifs yes mm. and then the free kit um, is the Santa uh, envelope your kit contains everything you need to make an envelope for a letter to Santa yeah so that is next month yeah, be intrigued what this one traditional not garden design that looks interesting so yeah and then on the back we have got a brief overview of what is in this magazine this time so there is definitely two in here that i would like to stitch so yeah definitely the uh central park new york and the challenge the darin jones uh the gingerbread charm challenge so yes definitely two i would like to stitch in there and the hoops look quite cute the hoops look quite cute too but yeah that is everything for this issue so yeah that is uh, everything for this time so watch out for the world of cross stitching coming um, probably either the end of end of this week or the beginning of next depending if we um, go to town later on in the week so I think the world of cross stitching is on sale on the 5th um, and today is only the 1st but yeah we've got a cross stitcher today so yeah watch out for the world of cross stitching coming um, but yeah that might not be for um, a week or so yet but um, yeah so that is everything for today guys so I'm going to let you go enjoy the rest of your week and remember guys in a world where you can be anything be kind bye guys <laughs>